All right, guys, back here, and I think in my other previous video I showed you this laptop, and uh, I decided, uh, I mean, before I even actually start using it, I want to actually add a uh, SSD drive and some more memory. So right now it currently has eight gigs, and I want to put in a 16 gig. Um, and the solid state drive, it's uh, what is it, uh, 250 gig? But mainly because this is actually a work laptop, and it goes in my laptop bag. I'm constantly bouncing this thing around and dropping my bag and this thing falls off ladders and stuff so I don't want actually a traditional hard drive in there because you know the worst thing you can do is drop your laptop while it's running you know especially with the traditional uh, platter style hard drives um, okay so I've never even taken this thing apart so I just uh, actually got this this morning and I went to the store and got SSD drive take the battery out just in case and I don't see, just by looking at this thing, you know, like I said, I don't have a manual for this thing. I haven't even bothered to go to Dell's website yet. I'm just going to try to figure it out as I go. So, I mean, there's only one place you can do, can, I mean, there's no compartment for memory or a hard drive, so I'm assuming the only thing I can do is take the lid off here, so let me do that. I'm going to take off all these screws and I'll try to pop it off and we'll see what's under this, uh, under this laptop here. Alright, so once I got the bottom cover screws, this thing, I mean, it looks like it just pops right up, I guess. So I'm assuming you're seeing what I'm seeing. Oh, I don't want to lose the screw. Alright. Alright, no, I do actually have extra screws just in case. Put that right here. Be careful not to lose screws. Okay, so what do we have? We have a hard drive and our memory. Supposedly this thing is supposed, it's hard, I, like I said, I got mixed reviews um, on what kind of memory, uh, how much does this thing hold. They say 8 gig, but um, another thing that I just saw is you should never mix, mag, mix, mix and match memory at a different speed. You should always have the exact same DIMM, so this is kind of a no-no. Um, 2, 4 gig, that's a, that's a 4 gig stick. So I'm going to take my crucial memory, and if this actually works, then I will put a link uh, where you can get this memory. Um, because sometimes, you know, like, it's, uh, there's been times in the past where I've had to go back to the store a few different times to get different kind of, different speeds of memory. Sometimes laptops can be picky with the kind of memory you put in them. So, this is Crucial. It's about, uh, around 150 bucks. I, to me, Crucial is like one of my favorite brands of memory. It's one of the few many, uh, it's a, one of the few chip manufacturers that actually manufacture their own chips. Uh, Micron. Micron actually owns Crucial, so you know, like Centon and and Kingston, they all actually they don't make memory chips. They just actually, you know, basically assemble the boards. Okay, 